These roots hold the future for Pari Island. Asmania and her friends are planting mangroves. Once mature, the trees will serve as a natural barrier to seawater erosion and reduce the risk of floods on the 42-hectare island, which lies just off the coast of Jakarta. Don't wait until we sink. Save Pari Island. That is their message, and it's a message they have now brought to court. Asmania is one of four residents of Pari Island who filed a lawsuit against cement giant Holzim in Switzerland over its contribution to climate change. Holzim is one of the world's biggest contributors to CO2 emissions, causing climate change that impacts our island. Fish stocks have declined, the seasons are unpredictable, the sea level is rising. Someone must hold Holzim responsible for these consequences of climate change. This field where the women of the village are planting vegetables is one of the few left that has not been flooded by seawater in recent years. Wherever you go on the island, the struggle against the encroaching sea is obvious. Many houses are flooded at high tide, but Arif Pucianto, one of the plaintiffs, is determined to stay. Since the constant flooding began in 2019, it's been difficult to get clean water. We used to rely on this fresh water well, but now it's even unusable for dishwashing. The local environmental advocacy group Walhi, which backs the islanders alongside a Swiss and a German NGO, is optimistic regarding the lawsuit. A similar environmental case against Shell in the Netherlands has recently been won. But they are preparing for a legal battle that could drag on for years. Holsim won't go bankrupt. We only demand three things, mitigation, adaptation and loss and damage. This means that we want to provide corrections to the existing production mode, not to bankrupt it. The four islanders are suing for 14,000 euros in loss and damages to be shared amongst them. A comparatively small amount, but for fisherman Mustakfirin, it would make a huge difference. They should be led by their conscience and take responsibility for what they have done. They reap so much in profit that they are blinded by it. They don't see that we are bearing the brunt of a climate emergency. A rapid reduction in the company's carbon emissions, which the lawsuit demands, could make a difference in the long run. The plaintiffs are also demanding better flood defenses and more mangrove restoration. The fight against the sea and global injustice on Pari has just begun. <laughs>